How's everyone doing? Good, good. Well, we just learned about some pollution and I wanted to ask you guys about some things that should and shouldn't be in the ocean. Now, we have little animals here. that are all gonna be affected. What do, you, do you guys think this should be in the ocean? You think socks should be in the ocean with the animals? No, you're right. Socks shouldn't be in the in the ocean. Bad for them. Not food. Potentially hurt them. Good, good. Oh. Look at this, he's drinking some coffee or a drink, you know? Do you think that's good for them? Do you think it's good for them to be drinking juices outside of the ocean? Yes, you? Yes, that's right, they shouldn't. It's not good for them. Well, how about this? Oh, uh, how about this? These six, six pack rings. Do you think this belongs in the ocean near the animals? Do you think it hurt them? Mm-hmm. Yes, this can this can hurt the animal and potentially make them not be able to swim by going around their fins and all that. Really bad for them. I was gonna say, campers, if you want, you can totally unmute yourselves and help Lewis find all the trash that's in the scene and tell him why it's not a good idea. Definitely feel free to unmute yourself and help him out. Oh, feel free to unmute. Oh, I can't hear you. I think you're muted. Um, <clears throat> rings do not go in the water because rings might get like stuck on maybe a like maybe a turtle's neck and it will hurt them really bad. Yes, yes, it can hurt them. It can really be damaging to them. Um, anything else? Do you see anything else that could potentially hurt, you know, the animals? Anything up over here, any the jellyfish? And the, the trash bag isn't, it doesn't belong on there because but if like a uh, animal is, like breathes it in and it gets stuck on their head and they might die because they can't breathe with that on their head. Definitely, definitely. This can definitely go on them and hurt them and make them not be able to take in the water and breathe. And that rope doesn't belong to you. Definitely. Um, because it might get stuck on um, a fish's fin, then trap them. Mm -hmm. It can definitely hurt them. Keep them on on the floor. Really bad for them. Anything else? Do you think that should be down here? This can of food? Do you think that should be down there? No. If somebody eats it and it gets stuck, then they can't breathe or eat anything else. It can be really bad for them. Ooh, underwear. Do you think that's good for them? No. Bad. Another thing that they can accidentally eat. Do you see anything else? Look, we see some starfish. What's near the starfish? Um, oh, it's newspaper. And that newspaper might get like soggy and wet. Then it might get like, get on their face and they can't get it off of them. And then it will like make their nose not be able to breathe and they would die. Definitely, really bad for them. Hmm. What about this water bottle? I mean, it's water, but do you think that should be down there? I don't think it's supposed to be down there because the um they already have water in there, and that bottle might like any plastic stuff, or, like any stuff that comes from land, is supposed to be in the ocean. Definitely, it might be water, but this plastic can still hurt. 
I think I see one more thing. I think I see one more thing that might be able to hurt these animals and keep them trapped. Yes? Go ahead. Let me do something. The, the box, um, okay. if I like trap them and like close on them and they won't be able to get out of it. Mm -hmm. Another thing. Um, do you think that's all? Do you think they're all safe now? Do you think it's a good environment for them now? Now that everything's gone? Yeah, now they can swim happily, live a good life.